Hi, welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team gives you an analysis with the information we got during our half trading day of July 12, 2019. Our objective is to give you alternatives to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. SP500 ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. We show you the Dow Jones Industrial ETF and it belongs to the bull high class. Our analysis shows you a strong opportunity to sell. We are expecting a sell return of 1.2%. This top opportunity has a minimum sell price of $270.28 but we expect a possible sell price of $275.34. We show you the NASDAQ 100 ETF and it belongs to the trade low class. Our analysis shows you a mild opportunity to sell. We are expecting a sell return of 1.8%. This top opportunity has a minimum sell price of $191.09 but we expect a possible sell price of $196.74. Let's look at the market sectors table. Our analysis is based on the sectors that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy energy sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected buyer return of 4.7%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $63.2 but we expect a possible buy price of $63.09. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell technology sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.3%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $82.13, but we expect a possible sell price of $82.26. Energy sector ETF belongs to the bull normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of energy sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy Valero Energy. You can observe. It has an expected buy return of 19.4%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $82.35, but we expect a possible buy price of $81.49. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to sell. Financial sector ETF belongs to the bull normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of financial sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy JP Morgan Chase. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 6.1%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $113.21, but we expect a possible buy price of $110.8. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell US Bancorp. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.7%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $53.94 but we expect a possible sell price of $55.06. Charles Schwab was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that Charles Schwab is a bare normal class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 1.6%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.8%. 
We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $40.72, but we expect a possible sell price of $41.47. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $37.11. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the Bear High class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of healthcare sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a strong opportunity to buy out by Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 20.9%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $68.65, but we expect a possible buy price of $68.58. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell United Health Group. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 8.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $250.11 but we expect a possible sell price of $269.13. Eli Lilly & Company is a strong new buy alternative. It is on a bare low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.4%. You may expect now a buy return of 12.2%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $109.66 but we expect a possible buy price of $106.85. In addition, we suggest to invest a maximum of 12.5% of your capital if you decide to buy it. Industrial Sector ETF belongs to the Trade Low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of industrials sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy United Technologies. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 8.9%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $129.64, but we expect a possible buy price of $129.31. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Boeing Company. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.2%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $360.89, but we expect a possible sell price of $367.49. Materials Sector ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of materials sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Sherwin-Williams. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 6.0%. You may sell at a minimum price of $472.56, but we expect a possible sell price of $479.67. Discretionary Sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today. Our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Consumer Staples ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell.
Let's look at the stocks table of consumer sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a mild opportunity to buy Netflix Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 14.1%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $373.47, but we expect a possible buy price of $362.72. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Costco wholesale. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.8%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $271.32, but we expect a possible sell price of $283.7. Amazon Incorporated is a strong new sell alternative. It is on a bull normal class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 1.9%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.2%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $1,981.62, but we expect a possible sell price of $2,107.24. In addition, we suggest to invest a maximum of 12.5% of your capital if you decide to sell it. Technology Sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Communication Sector ETF belongs to the bull normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of technology sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a weak opportunity to buy T-Mobile US. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 6.9%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $77.27, but we expect a possible buy price of $75.81. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Microsoft Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 8.5%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $138.82, but we expect a possible sell price of $142.4. Utilities Sector ETF belongs to the Trade Low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as an opportunity to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of utilities sector. Our analysis is based on the stocks that have the highest rating for buying or selling. There is a mild opportunity to buy Dominion Energy. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 5.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $77.07, but we expect a possible buy price of $76.63. Our analysis does not list a top opportunity to sell. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good update of our half trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.